Well, it looks as if the storm is lifting. The sun is trying to break through. They say we're gonna get a few more showers till about one, but it's hard to say. Could go either way, but that sun sure is uh, looking nice. Hello everybody, welcome back to Best Life and Beyond. Home is where the vlog is. I don't even know what number this one is. 25. Wow. Already it's been 25. 25 days. It's it's been a quarter, so to speak. 25. Wow. Okay. Uh, Katie is uh, getting ready. She just ran to the shower as I just pulled the camera out, and you heard her for a second, but she's gone. I uh, I'm starting things off here. It was cloudy and rainy. Obviously, but now it has kind of cleared up. Uh, the sun's out and uh, tide is going down currently. Uh, it's still chilly though. It's still a little chilly. It was like a winter storm in spring that we got here and uh, for us it was cold. So let's see what the day has in store. Uh, not sure yet. Just, you know, that's how it is with uh, home is where the vlog is. Anyways, let's, uh, let's get into the day. I don't know what it holds. Who knows? Does it matter anymore? No, we're just coming at you with some positivity and some, uh, some antics and some, uh, daily mundane lifestyle. It's become our forte laying around eating. Mm. And now it has come to <laughs> fruit roll ups, unicorn tongue tattoos. Look at this guy. It's got a sparkle in his eye. That's how I feel right about now. Just excited about the prospects of the day. And I'm having gushers. <sighs> what does the world come to? Mm. <laughs> okay, before I unroll the roll, look, you can see that there's a graphic in there. Let me see what I can find. There's a unicorn power one and then up there is a believe where the unicorn horn is the eye and the word believe all right so the idea i guess is that that will transfer onto my tongue let's see i don't know that's <laughs> i don't know if that's even possible uh, uh, ha, 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 ha. <laughs> what uh, uh, uh. uh huh it's because I believed in the unicorn, Katie. You must believe. It really wasn't that legible, but there was a transfer nonetheless. Now, I don't think it takes too long from what I... I think I kept it on there too long and it, it, it kind of bled. So... Yeah, it's a quick transfer. So what is yours? Uh, I'm going to do this one that says dream. Dream, an impossible unicorn. dream. Dream, Katie, that the unicorn will transfer magically onto your tongue. There it is. Oh, that's cool. That actually worked. And or disgusting. <laughs> that was a little violent. Whoa. I'm just kidding. Oh, I'll put up. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. This reminds me of like first grade being on the playground. Yeah. Sitting in the corner like. Oh, nature alert. Hummingbirds are back. There's one just on the other side. Those clouds are beautiful in the background right there. Let's see if he makes his way around or if it spins at all, but he's over there. All right, it's been a while, so it's time for the cheese ball check-in. Let's uh, first just, you know, do what needs to be done and just grab a sample. They're still fresh. I don't know how they do it. Even in this damp environment that we live in here at the beach. Amazing. So I think it's safe to say we're in this thing pretty deep. We're about halfway. Halfway. Kind of like the quarantine. I feel like we're about halfway. You feel like we're halfway through quarantine? Yeah. I we're, like that. I like we're, that optimism. We're in deep, I can tell you that. We're well into it. <laughs> um, it's uncharted territory, but we're here and um, all is well. Um, Things are looking up, seemingly. I don't know. Everybody's getting used to it, I think. Who's used to getting the cheese balls? Ready? Oh. 
Wow, just failing. That's the cheese ball check-in. Nothing much to say, but uh, things are looking up. There's a horizon, there's a, there's a glimmer of hope. There's like this tiny pinhole of light. Go to it, go to the light. All right, we made it down to the sand. Look at all this sand that piled up. It's a real steep angle. I don't know if you guys can tell, but a lot more sand came in last night. Still a little sprinkle coming down as we speak. Not clear yet. I had to break out the umbrella, and look who's joining us finally. Hi. Good morning. Well, afternoon now. Not really afternoon. I've been a busy gal. Busy gal? A happening gal about the town. <laughs> Think right. you needed a nice walk. Yeah. Even as, with a little drizzle, it's not bad. As did we. Nice. Yeah. A lot of sand came in, as we said, and uh, she's grabbing Vicky. Still, still rather blustery out there, look. chat so a few minutes ago yeah uh, they said that LA which I'm sure Orange County will be the same thing yeah um, said that we are still in the safer at home order shelter in place is no, that, no? Uh, it just said, well it's in safer at home I don't know what the difference whatever is. the technical term is so whatever you want to call basically, it basically May 15th or 16th yeah they've extended it uh, basically because another month. yeah originally this was supposed to be the spike maybe it still is I don't know probably need some time to come down off the spike. Maybe that's what this is. Right, uh, could be. I, I keep seeing a little bit more of like recovery cases and good stuff. Yeah, lots of glimmers of hope. Uh, things that are positive as opposed to, remember for a while, every day there was something negative that would take us bad. a little yeah. bit deeper and, and down that hole uh, a little bit darker. Now, it seems that the things we're hearing are like little glimmers of, of light and hope and Happiness, all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Little clues that might lead us to believe certain things. June like, 1st. Is uh, when he thinks it might open. That's what everybody's kind of speculating right now, uh, is June 1st for the parks. And we feel good about that. It seems it seems doable uh, based on what's happening right now and, and in the responsible manner that it would take to do that. I think June 1st would be achievable. I feel, yeah, I feel like as you know? long as I'm in by the anniversary on the 17th. Yeah, that was your goal. That is my is, goal. So I is it's smart. still attainable. I want yeah. my birthday inside of Disneyland like yeah. always. That's August 19th. So if I can have that. I'll honestly, I think anything earlier, I would, I would sit there and go, I don't know. Like, right. I don't want to get my hopes up for anything earlier because of the potential of it not happening. Well, and, especially and, for you know, safety purposes, too. Yeah. Like, you definitely don't want to push it. No. I don't want them to push it. No. So, but there's June a lot feels, of factors. June feels like pretty good to me. I'll take that. It uh, does. So, and it gives me a little bit of a countdown. Like, a little bit a little of a, bit, like, yeah. you know, before it was unknown, like, this could be forever. I don't know. Like It's it was, always nice when they give you some sort of a date. Yeah. Even if, like, let's just say because Universal said the 31st of May. Right. Um, it still kind of gives you hope because you're like, okay, so nothing until May 31st. Right. Even though you know that, subcon like you know that in the back of your mind, you're still like, oh, okay. Like, yeah. it just kind of makes it a little bit more like... It keeps it, yeah. Definitive, I guess. I don't know what yeah. you would call it. But yeah, it does kind of like uh, ease the... It eases the pain. All right, headed back. I always like the color change when you switch directions. Yeah, because up the other way we were walking toward was it, like a storm looking. Yeah, and this has all this nice reflective quality to it. Yeah. And uh, dramatic clouds. And... This looks beautiful. Yeah. Look at the horizon. Little it's waves crazy. coming in. They're thinking. Cruising. That's what you hear at night. Blue sky alert. Could this mean there'll be a sunset? Possibly. Possibly you. That'd be nice if we had a sunset tonight. We're fingers crossed. You just never know. I mean, yeah. 
this could all change, but those clouds, look at how cool. They are so beautiful. Those clouds look over there. It really does look pretty. Isn't that funny how like a storm and it just, it's gorgeous, you know? Look who's coming to say hi. Hello, Miss Cleo. She just couldn't resist. You're a wet doggy. She's you like, I just dog. had to say hi to my, just had to say hi. my fellow dog, Binky. Yeah. Look Thanks, Cleo. See you, girl. Bye, girl. She's like, wait, what? Oh, okay. She's always so happy. She is. Always. She's your, like, literal, typical lab. <laughs> the cell that's on us right now is that gray reaching the horizon. But if you look west, there's a break, and it's, uh, maybe that's the end of the storm. Okay, we're back up from the beach. Katie is, uh, making some, something that smells so garlicky that I don't care what it is. You could have harvested sand from the beach, uh, put it in a pile, put that, whatever you're doing. I'm gonna make a chicken pot pie. Oh, well that sounds better than a pile of sand, uh, <laughs> which I would have gladly eaten because you're a brilliant uh, chef. Thank you. You've been taking care of me this whole time. Good looking out. You're welcome. My best gal. <laughs> I love it a death. I love you too. With that in mind, uh, before, I eat more food. And based on the timeline that uh, is happening, might as well try to keep myself in shape or maybe try to get back into some semblance of shape. Inspired by my friends Adam the Woo. Good job, buddy. Sean, Sean James. Um, a lot of my friends are doing this uh, and starting out easy with like 10 push-ups as to not be too uh, presumptuous as to, you know, come on. So I'm gonna try 10, see how I do. I also have a, like a roller thing, like an ab roller. Well, you'll see. Um, so this is like a two-part thing, but uh, I'm going to try to hold myself accountable, uh, like Adam said, via the vlog, because um, you guys will ride me now, and now it's like I have, you know, my fitness coaches and you guys, so, and Katie, too. <laughs> She's like, I don't care. Um, but anyways, um, I guess nothing more to do, but I should stop talking and just do it, right? Okay. I might have to do them on my fist because I have bad wrists because I broke my wrist skateboarding when I was uh, a wee lad. So, let's see if I can even do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, ten. Yeah, that was really hard. That was no joke. You should have done that on your knuckles. Well, I have bad wrists. I can't do. I can't do the old. Uh, that was as good as I could do. Whew. All right, now for my little ab roller thing. Just a wheel with with two handles and uh, pretty effective. Let's see if I can <laughs> do a few of these. One. Two. Feeling that. Four. Five. Wow. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Let's just do one more. Eleven. You go to eleven. You can really feel that right in there. That's crazy, dude. Right there. Feel the core. Blasting the core, Katie. Okay, broke a sweat as you can see. Look, it's Good real. Job. It's real. All right, right. Give, give me more food so I can cancel that whole process out. <laughs> All right, I challenge you guys too. Uh, get something going, a little program to fit your uh, whatever works for you. Even if it's uh, a couple jumping jacks or whatever, a couple sit-ups, whatever works for you. I don't know. Just do something. We got time. All we've got is time, Katie. Time, time makes lovers feel you know, like the they're other, so The other thing though is that do work out a lot, it's okay to take a rest too. Yeah. So whatever it is you need to do, we need to be more active. Yeah, because we've been trying to be that way for a while and we just <laughs> couldn't find the time or, you know. I actually haven't had motivation. Yeah, motivation is like, most of it because then you can find the time. For uh, me it was easier when we could like go hiking and stuff, but yeah. I just, I have a hard time like doing something in the house like that. Like, like, I know. There's something to be said about getting the blood flowing and I already feel, I literally feel better almost instantly right now. Like a little bit of an endorphin rush. Um, 
I always did that at work. If I was really tired and working a long shift, I would do 10 or 15 push-ups, and it would wake me up, and it would just get the blood flowing around the body, and it would just, it was a challenge, so it was like, you know, true. mind over matter, and I don't know. Yeah, So it's true. I feel better already. But that's probably another reason why we like walking around Disneyland and all that stuff, because we yeah. really like... Disneyland walk. is our aerobic <laughs> workout, yeah, low-impact aerobic workout. There's a big set coming in right now. Clean, too. Kind of cleaned up. Crispy southwest line coming in. Wow. Another one right behind it. And then two more in the back. You see those other two lines? Actually, three. This is a long set. All right, we made it down to the sunset. Look at this painted sky. Unbelievable. Always great ones after the storm clears, but this is just phenomenal. A good sunset, man. That was really was, really was. Let's go head up and eat. Starving. Chicken pot pie. I took a couple bites. This was just all the extra. I had nothing better to do. I made a Mickey and a Minnie. Looks really good. <laughs> but um, it didn't make a whole pie. But I didn't want to do egg wash on it because I don't want to waste an egg. Yeah. So that's why it's not golden brown. But okay. it's cooked. Very festive. Um, this is the actual pie. Again, I didn't do an egg wash on it because we can't be wasting eggs like That's that. Fine. So, uh, we're going to cut into it. It's now kind of cooled. And we'll see. I mean, I tried it from the filling and it was something delicious. Okay. All right. Perfectly coming out. It's always the hardest to get the first slice out. Yeah. <laughs> always. Okay. This will do. Oh, it's set up, look. Nice. And I eyeballed everything. I didn't measure a thing. <laughs> this was full blown. It from smells my... really good if that's any consolation. Oh, so. it does smell good. <laughs> I can tell you. All right, if that's any indication, uh, if I were to give you a clock, that probably was about two, two minutes 30. <laughs> Gone. <laughs> Unbelievable. I'm gonna let that settle. Get back to the edit. And then at some point, making my way back over to, to this area right here, and uh, we're going to turn this Pac-Man into probably just a half moon. Yep. A little after dinner chat. Hey, look who it is. What's up, you guys? Oh, yeah! <laughs> it's the Erickson family, fresh baked. Are we in a Blab video? <laughs> You're in a Blab video right now, yep. <laughs> so yeah, we just wanted to say hi on the on the vlog, and we're uh, we're we're planning something right now that we're not going to tell everybody, but it's it's pretty awesome and it's in the works, and so uh, yeah, we're excited. <laughs> and, uh, I can't wait because I miss you guys. I want to make everyone. vlog you guys I so bad. I know we got to get back to what we do. So true. My my chihuahua just freaked out on my cat. <laughs> all right you guys I'll, I'll let you get back to the convo fresh bait all right well that wraps it up you guys hope you enjoyed the video uh that was fun talking to Liz Another, and Dave for a second yes it was and seeing baby Sophia yeah and stay tuned for uh, a, a killer collab of sorts or two <laughs> mm, probably a few uh but if you like this video please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel when you do turn on your bell notifications that way you know every time we upload our videos every morning yep. and when we go live and if you want to support best life and beyond you can become a patreon member we'll put all that information in the description box below that is right and we will see you next time on best life and beyond bye bye everybody <laughs> <laughs>